My name is Marian Anu and my proposal for SOLVE MIT Indigenous Communities Fellowship is Kamel Aina. Aloha. Before I dive into our proposal description, I would like to share an excerpt with you from Hanau Ka'ua, a book written by Vemomi Akana and Kiele Gonzalez, which is the most comprehensive record of Hawaiian rain names. Our kupuna had an intimate relationship with the elements. They were keen observers of their environment. With all of its life-giving and life-taking forces, they had a nuanced understanding of the rains of their home. They knew when a particular rain would fall, its color, duration, intensity, the path it would take, the sound it makes on the trees, the scent it carried, and the effect it had on the people. When I came across this book, it sparked something inside of me. Why don't I know this? What is my relationship with rain and with water? What do I want that relationship to become for me, for you, for our future generations? And how do we preserve and protect this resource now and into the future? There are two things that gave rise to our proposal, Kaleo Aina, the Nu'uanu Awai, and my fascination with it since my childhood and this book, Hanau Ka'ua. Mahalo for the opportunity to share more about Kaleo Aina with you. This was our team when we created the Kaleo Aina prototype. Currently, we are a two person team. Myself, Marian Ano, I am primarily involved in product design, software development, and curriculum, and Jeremy Taylor, who is our hardware engineer. Kaleo Aina Rainwatch Wearable Sensor is a wristband that alerts users when the ground sensor detects a rain event. Instead of a digital user interface, Kaleo Aina utilizes haptic signal technology so that students experience the outside as their user interface. Once the rain event is triggered, the rain starts collecting in rain barrels distributed and connected to the school's water management infrastructure, including gutters and drains. Through haptic technology, we maintain tactile and sensory experience for our children with a wearable that has no screen as an interface. Ultimately, Kaleo Aina aims to connect children to the interface between their observations of rainfall. Kaleo Aina Watch Wearable Sensor cultivates three skills for our keiki, kilo, observation, data collection, and decision making. Water becomes the medium that bridges Hawaiian culture to the foundational subjects taught in Hawaii schools. We aim to build observant children who are skilled in the native Hawaiian practice of kilo, or observation. We believe that our reconnection to water begins with kilo, and this level of training is the first step towards equipping our children with the kuleana of water protection, management, and conservation. After students kilo, they collect data, including the duration of the rain event and the volume of water collected in their rain barrels. The real magic behind Kaleo Aina lies in fundamentally shaping our children's relationships to rain and water and allowing them to decide how to utilize the collected water. We envision our children making decisions about water allocation for school gardening, scientific exploration, Hawaiian cultural studies, and other related studies and experiments on their campus. Before we leave you, we'd like to thank Nakupuna, Team Kaleo Aina, Purple Maya Foundation, and Purple Prize. Our inspiration, Hanau Ka'ua. I would also like to thank friends who reviewed this proposal and 
Colin Kobayashi that helped us to map out our prototype. We'd like to now share a short video of us testing our prototype. Uh, the light is still off. The Bluetooth connection. It's on now. Okay, yep, yeah, I'm in. Okay. Uh, put, ooh, yeah, put it in water. Oh, I should have sent it. Oh, yeah. And I got it in my debug on my app running. <laughs> 